it feels really good. I've been coming here for a few years now and uh, I think by this time, why I love this event is of course it's validation and recognition of all the great work that women leaders are doing in the industry. But it's also just a great time to catch up with friends. It feels great um, to be recognized for the work that you've done. And it feels great to be part of a company which is allowing you that opportunity that you can get noticed for the work you've done. So I want to thank Impact for it. I want to thank PNG for giving me the opportunity to be in this place. Uh, and really thank all the, all the lovely people in my life, both professional as well as personal, who've made it happen. Thank you so much. It's a, it's a difficult question because it's very difficult not to get caught up in stereotypes. Um, because I think every leader has a very distinct style, whether they are female or male, and there are many different styles of leadership which can make work. Um, that being said, I will go ahead and stereotype a little bit. Uh, I think women leaders work while building a lot of consensus. Not all of them may be the mega alpha women leaders, but I think they tend to be more inclusive, more caring, and a little bit more parent-child-like in the way they work with their teams. And I think that that's a, that might be different sometimes uh, from what many people are used to as the prototypical image of a leader. But I think that's a very, influ very effective way as well to lead teams. Uh, so I think that's one thing which I would think is different uh, with women leaders uh, that I have worked with and that I have really admired.